so all right guys welcome back in today's tutorial we're gonna do 3d wireframe model and then in next video we're gonna do machining of that model using area mill and peel mill but in this we're gonna draw 3d wireframe for that so let's get started for that first we have to go to wireframe then click on rectangle and select a rectangle of 4 by 4 of and then make our width to 8 inch lock it and make it anchor to center click ok and ok and you see a rectangle is created now we gonna create a re another rectangle which says rectangular shapes and make it a radius 0.25 gonna be in center and width and height gonna be 3 inch and its position in xy gonna be click over here to make it position and y gonna x gonna be negative 2 and y gonna be 0 click ok create another operation and this time our x gonna be 2 and y gonna be 0 click ok and you see i have two rectangles are created inner rectangles now we're gonna go to transform to make it 3d so click on translate select this hold shift and select the outer rectangle click on end selection make it to move make z negative to 2 inch then click ok and then select this rectangle and selection and this one make it to join negative 0.5 click ok and create another now select this one click and selection click it to move 0.5 click ok and then again select the same rectangle and selection and this time again same but click on join click ok and you can see our two rectangles are being made and now we are gonna click select hold shift and select bottom rectangle and go to translate and make it join to z 1.5 click ok you can see over there and it's joined now we're gonna go to our wireframe and click rectangle and then make it width of 4 and it's disable anchor to center and make this corner like here click ok and now go to transform again hold and select the rectangle just we created now go to translate and make it to move to 0.5 above so click ok and similarly now we're gonna create a line we go to wireframe line endpoints click on this line and then click on this line click ok go to this line and this line similarly with this corner and then over here to here and then click this corner to this line and now control a right click of mouse and click on clear colors now you can see the our wireframe is created so it's a 3d wireframe you can see over here so that's it guys thanks for watching and we're gonna do our machining of this wireframe in next video i'm gonna attach a link in description below so please go over there if you are interested in watching the machining of this wireframe we're gonna use in our first video peel mill and then i'm gonna make another video which gonna be on lesson 
area mill but the model gonna be same so you can continue watch this lesson in our next video as i provided a link in description thanks for watching guys if you found this video helpful please do like and please make sure to comment and give us a feedback and share with your friends and last please do subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and please make sure to watch our next video thanks for watching